Welcome to Yoga for Clear Skin and Digestion. So let's just close our eyes here, gently drop our shoulder blades down our backs, and just breathe, taking nice deep breaths in through the nose, and some slow deep breaths out. Just focusing on the breath. If any thoughts come into your mind, just acknowledge them, acknowledge their presence, and then just watch them float away, just like clouds in the sky. So don't even worry if you're thinking about anything right now. Just keep on bringing your attention back into your breath. Good, and so from here, on our next inhale, let's gently open our eyes. We're gonna reach our arms all the way up towards the sky. And then on our exhale, we're gonna walk our right fingertips up toward the right, getting a nice stretch through the left side body, gazing up at those left fingertips. And exhale from here, gently release, come back through center. Let's inhale here, reach those arms all the way up towards the sky. And then on your exhale, walk those left fingertips out to the left, get a nice stretch through that right side body, gazing up at those right fingertips. Awesome, and then so from here, let's gently release. Let's place our hands behind us, clasp our fingers together, and really stretch, really open up through the chest, squeeze those shoulder blades together, and gently look up. Good, and then release here, place your hands onto your knees, and then roll through your spine. So bring your shoulders forward, bring your belly button in towards your spine. Just bring your head in towards your chest. Awesome. From here, let's come into a tabletop position. So we're going to bring our hands right underneath our shoulders, bring our knees right underneath our hips. And we're going to tuck through our toes, so coming onto our toes. And then we're going to bring our knees up and back, coming into our downward facing dog. Really bringing our heels down towards the mat, really stretching out throughout the shoulders. And from here, let's inhale, reach the right leg up towards the sky. And then on your exhale, you're going to step it in between your hands. You're going to come up into your lunge. So it's up to you if you want to come up into your crescent lunge, bringing your knee down, or if you want to bring your knee up. Just depends on the level of strength you have. So we're just going to warm up through the core here, really warm up through all of those digestive organs. So on our inhale, we're going to reach our arms up. And then on our exhale, we're going to bring our torso forward. So we're going to squeeze through our core. And then we're going to inhale, bring our arms out, out towards the back, and then circle the arms all the way up. So inhale here, and then exhale, bring it down. Inhale, bring it up, and exhale, bring it down. Good. So let's do three more here. Inhale up, exhale down, last two, and last one. Inhale up, exhale, bring it down, and then inhale, bring it all the way back up. If you're tired, you can always bring that knee down. Inhale here, place your left hand either on your left hip or all the way down your left thigh. Then reach your right arm up and over your head. Really try to get even more of a stretch through your torso. Sink down through your hips. Inhale here and then exhale, lower that hand back down. You're going to step that right foot back, come into a plank. Bring your knees down if you, here if you need to. Rotate those triceps inwards. Inhale here and then exhale, lower chaturanga. Make sure your elbows are right beside your ribs. Good, press here, the tops of your feet into the mat, press your hands into the mat. You're gonna inhale here, coming into your cobra pose. So just opening up through your chest. And then on your exhale here, you're gonna come through your child's pose. And then tuck through your toes. And then bring your knees up and back, come back into your downward facing dog. And let's take this one on the other side. So we're gonna inhale, reach that left leg up. And then on your exhale, you're going to step it forward. Remember, you can bring your knee down if you need to. Let's inhale, reach those arms up. And then on your exhale, start with that flow. So squeeze your core, bring your arms down, and then inhale, lift everything up. It's almost, almost as if you're doing like a full sh shoulder rotation. You're just opening up through your chest. You're really working through all of those muscles that are all around those digestive organs. Just trying to make everything nice and fluid. Good, let's do two more here. And last one. 
Good. Coming all the way back up, bring that knee down if you need to. Press your right hand in towards your right hip or all the way down your right leg and reach that left arm up and over. Really opening up through your chest, really stretching out through that side body. Good. Take a nice deep breath in here. And then on your exhale, bring everything down. Step your left foot back. Come into that plank pose. Knees up or down. Rotate those triceps inward. So really try to bring the creases of your forearms to point towards the front of the mat. And then lower your body down. Inhale here. Come up through your cobra pose. So really squeeze those shoulder blades down your back. Awesome. And then exhale from here. Come into your child's pose. And just take a bit of a break. And really try to tune into your breath. So your yoga practice really is just gonna be all about your breath, all about how much you can keep your breath consistent throughout everything that your yoga practice gives you and really everything that life brings you as well. So let's just connect to that breath here. Good, and so from here we're gonna do one more little flow. So we're gonna come onto our knees. We're gonna bring our hands onto our hips. We're gonna come into a camel flow. So this one's really gonna be really nice to open up through the shoulders and really work a little bit more through this torso area where all of our digestive organs are. All right, so we're gonna start here by placing our left hand onto our hip and then reaching our right arm up and over our head, really opening up through our chest, bringing our hips forward. And then on our exhale, we're gonna bring our right hand down we're gonna bring our hips down towards our heels. We're gonna bring our right hand onto our right hip, and then we're gonna reach that left arm up. Good, bring it down, then bring the right arm up. Good, so and if you feel like you have lots of flexibility here, you can bring, you can tuck through your toes and then bring your hand onto your heel. So bring that left arm up, and then bring the sit bones down, good. So inhale on your way up, exhale on your way down. Good, let's just do two more here on each side. And last one. Perfect, so from here, just gently bring your sit bones all the way down onto your heels. Place your left hand on your heart, your right hand on your belly, and just breathe. Breathe nice deep breaths. So the deeper and the more natural that we breathe, the more that we increase our blood flow and just really our circulation throughout our entire bodies. And the better that is for aiding in our digestion and really getting that gorgeous, nice glowing skin. So we're just releasing all of our stress with each breath that we take. Good. So finishing off this flow here, on our next inhale, let's reach our arms all the way up towards the sky, really opening up through the chest, really pushing up through the ribs. And then on our exhale, let's bring our hands up for our heart center. Just close your eyes here and breathe. Good. So feeling all the beautiful sensations within your body right now. Try to bring this feeling with you throughout the rest of your day. Namaste.